Hmm. Hmm. Hey, thanks for joining me today. You know I'm corny. You don't want me to talk about reticular activation systems and psychological babble like that, do you? I didn't think so. I do use a lot of psychology and guts. I do a lot of research, especially when it comes to persuasion and influence. And one of, one of the greats of psychology, I will do a little psycho babbling on this segment today, is Sigmund Freud. He emphasized the importance of the unconscious mind. A primary assumption of Freud and his theory is that the unconscious mind governs the behavior to a greater degree than most people suspect. I'm getting to a point here. Hang in with me just one more second. The goal of psychoanalysis and all the psychology books and everything, at least if they're Freudian, is to make the unconscious mind conscious, to bring those thoughts that are subliminally, that subconscious mind to the front. We do that in sales all the time. I've talked about painting a picture. You're the painter. They're the easel. They're the blank piece of paper, using sights and smell and touch, uh, telling stories all the time. We're trying to paint a picture in their mind, get an idea in their head, so that when you get off the phone, what do you want them to think? What do you want them to think about you or say about you? That's your responsibility. See, in Guts, we take responsibility. Anybody, 99% of people who train in sales, just teach you how to read a script and ask for the order five times. And um, it's real boring. And it's really, I think, annoying to most prospects. We want to do something different. We want to have a conversation with a prospect, an adult to adult conversation. We want to learn to ask the right questions that get the prospect's attention, get them interested, and get them thinking about how our product or service whether it's real estate or whatever you sell, is on their mind. And we want them also to like us, to trust us, because these are great influential factors. We want when we get off the phone or when we send a marketing piece or when we leave a guts voicemail, I'll talk about that in another video, that they're thinking about us, our product. They're thinking about their situation. They're thinking about what the value of what we're offering all day long, or maybe for a couple days. A lot of times when I speak to my prospects or when I'm doing role play training, I do a lot of role play training. I'll do a video on that too. Um, I try to practice with people and paint the picture about what's their needs, what's their problem, what's their budget, how soon do they wanna solve that problem? Do they have the authority and the character to make a commitment? And I'm gonna take all that information and put it into a story and try to incorporate all the different senses so that it's in their subconscious and it works its way up to the front and they're thinking about you and your product and your company all day long. That's how you close a lot more sales and make a lot more money and have a lot, frankly, a lot more fun. Does this sound hard? It is hard. Is it worth it? You better believe it. I have a great life. I have a wonderful life here, financially and otherwise, because I give good fun, like the sign says, because nobody deserves success more than you and me. We deserve the success, but we've got to incorporate these scientific and acting skills into our daily sales presentation. It's, it's the million dollar skill, guys. I'll say it for as long as I'm on this planet. And nobody... Um, I said that already. My phone number is 970. I do this spontaneous. I think you can tell. 970-281-5151. I do answer my own phone. If you like these videos, um, uh, give me a thumbs up and I uh, hope I didn't cycle babble too much, but this stuff really works. And you have to, you can't just read it and you've got to incorporate it and practice it every day. Take care.